Hey guys, West Coast Picks here, and today I'm going to talk a little bit about IC cores. And uh, the first thing you're going to notice is my video quality is a hell of a lot better, or at least it should be. Um, I've got a new camera, and with it comes a new microphone, and hopefully that's good too. Um, but uh, it's not like a $200, $300 webcam or anything like that. It's a hundred dollar webcam hopefully it's a compromise I'd rather spend money on locks than money on video but I realized that my video call it quality was so crap you could barely see anything so hopefully this is a good compromise <coughs> anyway these IC cores um, all of four of these came from one place and I'll talk about that in a little bit um, but I'll talk about these two first and uh, this one which is your quintessential IC core. This is a best IC core with a A style keyway. So when most people are talking about SFIC cores or a best core, this is pretty much what they're talking about. This is where uh, it started. I don't know if it's where it started, but uh, this is the format that everybody follows. And uh, basically what you get is you get an access key and a control key. This access key will only turn this lock, work the cylinder, you can see the back here, it will uh, actually actuate it. And this control key will not actuate that back cylinder. All it will do is move that little toggle out of the way. And you can see that. So it moves out of the way there. So you can pull it in and out of the lock. And uh, the only reason I have this lock on the table is to demonstrate. So toggles in, insert it into the lock, turn it, pull it out. Now it's in the lock, it's not going anywhere. You can operate the lock with the access key, just like normal. And if, oh, sorry, new lock. <laughs> and if for whatever reason <clears throat> you want to change your cores, you want to change the key on that lock, uh, or for whatever reason you want to swap out cores, pull it out, put it in a different lock, uh, put a different core in the lock, whatever. <coughs> so uh, that is a standard six pin best with an A style keyway, which is pretty much uh, the standard where this uh, SFIC stuff started or what have you. This here is a Medico made by, I can't remember who made it, Keymark I think called an X4 by Medico. I don't know if you can see the, uh, actually you should be able to spend money on this thing. Come on. Come on, focus. Anyway, it's supposed to autofocus and apparently it's not doing it. Now, uh, I see <coughs> Bosnian Bill's problem here. Come on. Uh, it almost did for a sec. Anyway. It says Medico X4 on it. Um, that's kind of a bummer, you know. You spend all that money, you think you can get autofocus to happen. 100 bucks and you can't autofocus on something I'm holding right in front of you. Come on, please. Look at that. Oh, I'll give it a minute. Nope. I'll give it an hour. Doesn't there. Wait. There we go. Yay! So you got to get enough in front of the camera that it knows, hey, uh, everything's up close. But anyway, the same principles apply with all these IC cores. These are all different, by the way. No, no two are the same. Uh, there's three bests amongst all this, but they're not the same. Um, they're different keyways. That's the only difference. Uh, same as this. Um, the only real difference is the key is very restricted on these Minico X4s and um, but the same thing so put in the one key operates it put in the other one and you get your control slide it into the lock use your key like normal all right so they're all like that and i'm not going to throw all these in and out of this core or out of in and out of this lock or even take them out of the bag really. This was just to show you. Uh, that medical actually has two sliders on the key. You can see the cut there. 
the um, key itself on the bottom there's two reliefs for a couple sliders in the lock so uh, it's a seven pin with those two little slider things so it would be a little harder to pick and all of these the way they work is they have two different shear lines and uh, those different shear lines you have to meet that one shear line for either operating or control and uh, you can't mix the two so it makes it a little difficult to pick but because there's inherently no security pins in these things um, you can rake them if you rake over and over and over you'll either get control or access one of the one of the times so anyway these four are all different and I got them from a really cool guy online there I found him on eBay and I sent him an email to ask him a question and I ended up just uh, ordering through him personally uh, and I heard about him on the forum too so I kind of trusted his name but um, <clears throat> this one is a uh, seven pin a keyway so it's an a key but uh, generic it says but if you look really close you can see on it, it actually says Falcon uh, almost worn away and this one is a six pin chrome falcon with uh, an A keyway so so far these three here are all the same key um, two different manufacturers and of the two ones that are the same manufacturer one's a six pin and or sorry six pin and a seven pin one's, one's chrome and one's brass um, and then a a six pin best with a D keyway which is different from the A of course they won't fit in and uh, a J keyway best with a six pin what I like uh, about him he didn't put these in, in the bags he had them in different bags and he didn't have these pieces of paper cut up and put in here uh, he printed it out on a full piece of paper I cut them up and put them in these bags but I mean the fact that he even printed out all the bidding information and put it on you know a piece of paper for you so you can actually have it <laughs> and uh, each key sorry each core came with two keys uh, access keys and one control key well, I have kind of asked for it but uh, I don't know if that's how they normally come but um, yeah that's pretty much it and all four of these cost less than this one best that I went to a locksmith a locksmith in town happened to have one I asked him well how much he charged me 65 bucks for this best core a keyway six pin uh, with one control and one access key this was like 45 for all four of those so you know just keep that in mind if you want to get a hold of this guy um, just email him his website's not really up to date or anything or at least not that I found maybe I was looking in the wrong place but um, <clears throat> his email is on there his name's Tim it's a really nice guy uh, and man he says he's got thousands of them uh, so if you're looking to get into uh, FS sorry SFIC core stuff uh, talk to him you can get padlocks you can get uh, like more T cylinder deadbolt style uh, pretty much anything that'll take a core uh, you can get for SFIC so uh, yeah check them out guys uh, there'll be videos later of me picking these I'm, I'm pretty sure and for some reason my focus doesn't want to go back but uh, what do you do oh here show you that too it's uh, something that it, he sent in with the rest of the billing and all that stuff so I guess those are his prices if you want to pause on that screen take a look at that anyway have a good one guys and try not to break any laws